Good morning everybody and Merry Christmas. It is Christmas Day today. I am so excited. I am at the Magic Kingdom. It is 4 o'clock in the morning. The park is set to open at 6 a.m. and it's supposed to hit capacity by noon. So I decided to come out and get an early, early rope drop. Let's go do this. Nobody else is out at this moment. Look at the bus stations are just empty. Buses just lined up. Monorails just sleeping. Well, they're actually changing tracks if you see right there. How cool is that? It has been a very long time since I've done a rope drop. And what better day than on Christmas Day itself? One of the busiest days of the year at the Magic Kingdom. I'm telling you, it feels so surreal just being here. And like usually you just hear bus noises and just people enjoying their vacations. It is a ghost town. It's so crazy. And this is something you certainly don't see very often. Nobody here. And I guess I was too early for my rope drop adventure on Christmas Day because security isn't even in place yet. So they actually asked me to come wait over where the uh, bus stops are for the resort guests. And then uh, once they all get set up, I'm gonna go in. And I might be the first one in Magic Kingdom on Christmas Day. Do you know how great that makes me feel? It is five o'clock now and the music on Main Street just turned on. Hopefully they're gonna let us in very soon. There's only one other person here. First one here, look at this. I don't think I can, oh I can. Oh, I'm running, I'm running. I don't want anyone to beat me there, I'm so excited. Well, I'm here. So I got to the turnstile and now I'm just waiting, but now a lot of people are coming. I'm so excited. Look at everybody ready for Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, Merry Christmas! <laughs> I am just so excited. Literally, I cannot contain it actually. I've been waiting here since 3.30, 4 o'clock. So it's definitely worth it. Oh boy, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh no, I'm stopped right here. All right, can we just look in? Oh, <laughs> Ooh, thank you. Oh, time's guide, yes, very important. <laughs> Here I am, just one more step, and I'm gonna be in the Magic Kingdom. Here you leave today and enter the world of yesterday, tomorrow, and fantasy. The thing is, though, now both sides are actually lined up right where we're at, so it's gonna be a race. It's gonna be a race to the castle. And look at, they're dropping off money. Do you see the Garda truck? <laughs> lots and lots of eager people behind me, ready to celebrate the holidays. Look at this. I'm so excited. Oh, that's it! Yeah! Woo! It's slippery! <laughs> hey, look at everyone's running! <laughs> oh, Magic Kingdom! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was worth it. <laughs> wow, awesome, isn't it? Look at this, guys. Christmas morning. <laughs> so, I really want to get a very cool time lapse. I'm sorry, everybody's jogging. I feel like I need to keep up with them. And just think, in just a few hours, this park will be so busy that they will have to stop letting people in. Everybody's lining up to get to their favorite lands, like going over to Fantasyland or Tomorrowland. I'm just here for the castle and Main Street. I am so happy I got to see these beautiful Christmas lights on Christmas Day. Unfortunately, I have work tonight, so I won't be able to be back here for the nighttime. But wow, I'm happy I got to see it. 
and those lights too. Look how many people are lining up to get an early morning. Oh. In just 10 minutes, all of the lands of the Magic Kingdom will be opening. We encourage you to make your way to Cinderella Castle for a very special presentation. Thank you. So as you just heard, the actual morning show is going to happen at the castle in just a minute. So we're going to head back up that way, but I just wanted to come back down and walk down Main Street again before it really gets overcrowded. Like I said, it is so surreal that in just a couple of hours, this place will be so busy that they will not let anyone else in. There's even a line for Starbucks. Huh. The line for Starbucks is actually longer than some of these photo pass spots. But you do need to have your Christmas coffee. I mean, that's very important. Look at this. Isn't it awesome? It's unbelievable. I mean, you can do this multiple times, but it's very rare that you're actually like this on Christmas Day and at 5.30 in the morning. Right now, the only two sounds I'm hearing is that water fountain and the Christmas music. That's pretty awesome. I can't believe that I can say that I was the first person at Magic Kingdom on Christmas Day. I mean, I know, does that sound like corny? I feel like honored. I really feel like honored, like I accomplished something today. In just five minutes, all of the lands of the Magic Kingdom will be opening. We encourage to say the run-in was a little intense now I didn't like run full speed but there were some people that were running like full speed and it was very slippery you could tell they were just washing the floors right before we actually got in so you gotta be careful if you ever do this don't slip and it's beginning hear ye hear ye welcome one and all to this magical kingdom it is hereby decreed that all are welcome in this happy place where the young and young at heart can explore and laugh and play together. Here, where magic awaits you around every corner, bursting with the joy and inspiration to make your dreams come true. And now, let the magic begin! <laughs> so now that we are actually open for business here at the Magic Kingdom, I'm going to head on over to Tomorrowland and we're going to see if any of those Christmas overlays are running, especially on Christmas. Okay, so the Tomorrowland Speedway has the Christmas overlay on. I'm going to bet that it's happening on Space Mountain. Wow, I am so excited. I really hope it is. So you can see, like I said, the Tomorrowland Speedway is all lit up for the Christmas overlay. We're gonna risk it. We're gonna get in line at Space Mountain. So I am pretty sure we just got confirmation that there is the holiday overlay on Space Mountain. I am so pumped. It is my favorite overlay out of any of them. It is hands down my favorite. And Danny and Adam, first time on the holiday overlay. This is gonna be amazing. We're gonna join your party. Yes. To the moon. The four group. The four group. We're blasting off soon. Fun fact: I do not like the front. Adam's taking the front. I feel like if you're gonna lose your hands, I'm safe. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh. We can sit here and listen to the music.
it's a joy. <laughs> I can honestly tell you that there are things that I get so excited about. Today, riding Space Mountain with the holiday overlay is one of those things. Literally, pure joy. I love it so much. So we made it over to the Tomorrowland Speedway. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, guys! <laughs> For the holiday overlay. Oh boy, here we go! Oh, look at the lights! I'm not a good driver! <laughs> oh, so pretty! <laughs> Gonna take it nice and slow because this is all the pretty stuff right here. Wow. Oh no, listen! They're playing one of my favorite songs from the Osborne Lights. We did the Tomorrowland Speedway and Space Mountain. We might as well do the other holiday overlay they're offering today on Christmas. The teacups. Isn't it crazy? We have done two rides in just the first hour. Normally, these rides during a party would probably take you an hour alone just to do Space Mountain. But we got them both done, and now the third overlay within our first hour. Right, this is great. It's nothing like a full teacup, huh? <laughs> Never go full teacup. <laughs> no spin, light spin. <laughs> I'm doing all the work. <laughs> Moderate spin. I just like the music and the lights. Oh, that one's empty. This is great. <laughs> All right. Aww. Appropriately. I accomplished it. Okay, there you go. Oh, it makes that weird noise, that weird stopping noise. Clink. Clink. So I want to say thank you to Matilda, who actually seen us waiting in line in the Astro Orbiter and brought us some Christmas snacks. How sweet is that? It's been a long time since I've been on the Astro Orbiter or in an elevator. <laughs> uh, three, please. Thank you. <laughs> Why are there multiple? Oh, okay, I see. One, two. Heat belt fastened, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside. And please, supervise younger pilots. This is great. It's a little dreary out right now, but honestly, it is 7, 10 a.m. We have gotten so much done today. I'm excited to see the castle, though, before the lights get shut off. Actually, as we're in flight, they might shut off. To make your rocket ship off. fly higher. Oh, boy. Come to a complete and final stop. Oh. At this time of it is now 7.20 a.m. We have done four different rides, three holiday overlays, and it's just so amazing. 
Today is a great day. You know, people usually say never go to Magic Kingdom on Christmas Day, but if you get here early enough, it's the best thing in the world. Look at all those birds. Someone dropped popcorn. This is still Christmas, guys. It might only be 7.30 a.m., but I was expecting a lot more of a turnout than this. I mean, look at that. There is nobody on the pathway up to the castle. Huh. Just more of an empty Magic Kingdom. Now, like I said, it's not gonna be like this for long. Come around 10 a.m. or 11 a.m., capacity. I know and things are starting to look a lot busier here. Just a few hours ago, we were walking in this way and nobody was here. Look at the toy soldiers up there. Oh, how cool is that? And they're just playing music. I love it. And with that, I think I'm calling it a morning because it's still morning. I only came out just for a little bit Christmas day. I have to go to work tonight, but it was well worth it. Such an amazing, amazing day. Adam, thanks for hanging out. Danny702, thanks for hanging out. Make sure you check out both their channels. Seriously, Merry Christmas. Love the life you live. We'll see you next time. Bye.